here and this video I'm covering a topic about starting an online business when you have a very limited budget and I created this blog post because I've received a few messages recently from people who have read um, some of my past blog posts or watched some of my YouTube videos that explain uh, how to get started with an online business uh, sometimes for free or when you have a limited budget. So I decided to create another blog post covering the topic because I feel like there's uh, many more people out there, maybe even yourself, that want to start an online business and you don't have uh, very much to get started with. And I can relate because I was in that same position a few years ago. So uh, there are uh, multiple kinds of online businesses you can start, but there's only a few, if that, that you can start with a very limited budget. Uh, affiliate marketing is one, but in this uh, blog post, I cover drop shipping because that is another one that doesn't require a lot of startup cash and you can actually turn a profit a lot faster. So uh, the title of this blog post is a small budget online business. You can start for under $200 and I talk about drop shipping and I start off by explaining why so many people like the drop ship model and the reason is because uh, you don't have to buy any inventory up front uh, you only purchase inventory when a customer buys a product from your store so what happens is you uh, locate some drop shipping suppliers uh, once you do you can put their products into your online store and when they sell you sell them for whatever price you mark them up for. When a customer uh, places an order, then you p pass along that inform shipping information to the supplier. You order the product. The supplier then ships that item to your customer for you. So you don't even have to deal with um, any type of shipping and handling either. So where would you find some drop shipping suppliers? Where there's... Uh, several uh, places that you can uh, locate them. Uh, the more popular option that a lot of um, people start with is AliExpress. And the reason being is that you can find uh, tons of products on here and they're listed for pretty much wholesale prices. So they have tons of it pr pretty much anything you could ever think of is sold on this website and so let's say that uh, you know you are choosing a niche and I'm gonna use the avocado niche I know it sounds weird but <laughs> if you uh, go back to some of my one of my blog posts I talk about choosing fanatical niches and so I know that there are avocado fans a lot of people that love avocados so if I type in uh, like avocado shirts for example into AliExpress you can see there's tons of different uh, t-shirts and things dedicated to avocados these are types of shirts that fans would actually buy some of them are really are funny some of them just show uh, appreciation for uh, avocados so uh, there's other things you can uh, look up to so like uh, another thing that people would buy that are avocado fans would be socks so you could I could sell these you know in a store and other related items so there's all types of products um, avocado art you know th there's pictures and look like, phone cases you know all kinds of things that can go into a drop shipping store and so AliExpress is a great option and if the reason being too is if you look at the price of some of these products from 99 cents to a dollar 99 a piece so if I were to sell any of these avocado phone cases I could mark them up for, you know to 8.99 or 9.99 and then I'm making a seven or eight dollar uh, profit from each phone case so you can see that the prices are reasonable and there's so many options and this is a reason why so many people use AliExpress to drop ship and it's not a bad way to start you may you know read uh, some pros and cons about using AliExpress well that goes with any drop shipping supplier because in the end you're relying on someone else to fulfill your orders 
but if you know what to look for, you know um, how to research and find good suppliers within AliExpress, then it really isn't a problem. And I have a video in which I talk about how to find good suppliers on AliExpress and I'll link that below. So once you find your drop shipping supplier, like I said, this is just the easiest way if you're ready to get started and you're on a limited budget, AliExpress is a great place to start. Um, then, you know, the next thing, usually I recommend doing your niche research, uh, just figuring out what type of store you want to open. I wrote a blog post about some trending niches uh, that I looked up not too long ago. I'll link to this as well. And just to go over some, uh, the mini cameras, those are awesome. You know, that's something that you could sell. Uh, no tie shoelaces. It could be an add-on to maybe if you're looking to sell shoes. Uh, gamer glasses for uh, protecting the eyes when viewing the computer screen. Uh, dash cameras that uh, you put in your car. Posture corrector. That's for some reason is trending pretty high. <laughs> uh, tactical gear. There's tons of uh, items that you can sell. Phone tripods, phone cases, and such. Uh, reading lights, uh, another great niche. Uh, memory foam pillows, and again, these are things you can find on AliExpress, all of these things. And arch support. So uh, this post, uh, you know, just gives you uh, some ideas that you can start brainstorming to get into what it is that you want to sell. Now, once you have your niche, you know your supplier, which is Ali Dropship, then the next step is actually opening your store. Now, in most cases uh, for under $200, you can open your store with Shopify, and Shopify is one of the most popular uh, e-commerce platforms in general, and particularly for dropshippers. But um, if you want to test drive them, by all means do so. But the reason why I don't um, outright recommend them is because if you're on a budget, you will have to pay a monthly fee to use Shopify. Uh, their basic plan starts at $29 a month. And then in order to begin drop shipping with Shopify, you do have to use a drop shipping app. And in most cases, um, you'd likely want to use the Oberlo app. It's their own app. They bought this company. And oh, the good news is Oberlo is free to use, but there are some limitations on the free version. So eventually, uh, as you, your store grows, you would have to move up at $29.90 a month. So between the two, you're looking at a minimum of $60 a month to um, run your store. And so the reason why I don't uh, recommend these two so much is because if you're on a budget, that's a bit much starting out, especially if you haven't turned a profit yet. So what I uh, recommend instead is to use WordPress because WordPress is free uh, and you can also use WooCommerce which turns WordPress into an e-commerce platform but you don't have to. And then you do need a drop shipping software and the one that I use and recommend is Ali Dropship and what this is is a WordPress plugin and the the great thing about this is if you're on a budget, you only pay for this plugin once. So you buy it for $89 and then you do not have any monthly software fees. And it has pretty much all the same features, if not a bit more than the Oberlo app. So with this plugin, there are no limitations in terms of how many products you can import. There are no um, limitations as far as uh, profit margins, um, how much you can make. It comes with tons of features, uh, searching for products that have e-packet shipping, which just is just a faster shipping uh, method from China to the US and other locations. This software automatically updates your pricing and inventory levels. It also automatically processes your orders and sends out your tracking information to your customers. And so it pretty much is full featured. 
And another thing that's great about this plug is when you buy it, they give you the default version, which works just with WordPress. And they also give you the WooCommerce version. So you get both versions of the plugin. So if you want to use WooCommerce, you have that option. And if you just want to use it with WordPress, you have that option as well. And so another thing I recommend is when you order this plugin, and I talk about it down here in this section of the blog post, what you want to do, just make this simple because you don't want to be running around trying to find the best hosting for this plugin or just hosting for e-commerce stores. Just bundle in the Yali Dropship hosting for $48 a year. Extremely affordable. Most hosting providers will charge you a good $70 uh, for a year, if not a little more. So $48 for a year is extremely cost effective. But not only that, they will install WordPress and the Ali Dropship plugin for you, and it includes free SSL, which you're going to need anyway because you're running an e commerce store. So I say bundle it in. Your total will be $137, which puts you well under that $200 uh, budget. Once you have your store installed, the next thing you're going to want to do is begin importing products from AliExpress into your store. Now, the way that you can do this is with the Ali Dropship Chrome browser extension, and I created a video as well on how to use that. And so it's on my blog page, but I'll link to that below as well. You can import an unlimited number of products. And if you want to make it even simpler, <laughs> another great plugin that you can install is the Dropship Me plugin. And this plugin is created by Ali Dropship as well. And so what this plugin does is that they have already manually selected over 50,000 of the best selling products on AliExpress. So all that you have to do is do a search once you install the plugin is you do a search for the different products that you want to put into your store and it will return to you the best selling products as well as products with the most reliable uh, suppliers so you don't have to do any of that research on your own literally all you'd have to do is click import and it will import into your store all of the descriptions will be done for you the titles will be already edited, images already edited. So this plugin, I'm telling you, it's worth the download. This one is free. You can install it, start using it for free. They give you the first 50 product imports for free. And then later on, if you need more products, then you can uh, pay a one-time fee, just like the Ali Dropship plugin. And uh, they have different packages here. And then you can import as many more products as you want. So definitely worth uh, using this plugin in addition to the Ali Dropship plugin. So once you have your products installed, the next step of course for your store is promotion. And the great thing about this is that you can promote your store using free methods as well as paid methods. And I've recently begun experimenting with Instagram and I wrote a blog post about uh, beginner tips, just things that I've picked up and learned from using Instagram. And I will link to this blog post as well as a video that I created so that you can uh, find out just some really basic stuff as well as maybe something that you may not have thought of in terms of uh, promoting products and things for your store. So of course, like I said, I was using the avocado niche as an example, and it seems to be working out great. I'm getting followers every single day. I get people to uh, visit my store. So this is something that uh, I recommend checking out, and I'll definitely link to this information as well. Uh, paid ads, you can definitely you still use uh, Facebook and uh, Instagram, Pinterest, just depends on uh, the route you want to take. Many drop shippers uh, have much success with Instagram shoutouts, and um, I know that Ali Dropship has a great blog post about using shoutouts for beginners, as well as a video, and I'll link over to that as well because that's something that uh, 
you definitely want to check out. So that is uh, pretty much covers everything in terms of starting an online business when you're on a small, uh, pretty much a limited budget. So for well under $200, you can get started with drop shipping. Drop shipping, uh, you know, the it's uh, in terms of free online business. Like I say, I I like affiliate marketing, drop shipping. But as far as turning a profit faster, I think drop shipping would be ideal in that sense because as long as you uh, stay consistent with your marketing efforts, there really isn't a reason why you shouldn't make a sale and um, make several sales per month depending on how hard you are willing to work. So that being said, I hope this video uh, helps you out if you were in search of a online business that you can start when you're on a budget. Uh, please check the description below as I will link to all of the things that I mentioned in this video. And please subscribe if you haven't already as I create more videos around online businesses in general. Thank you so much for watching and talk soon.